had a quick look around. There's one door into the castle that isn't under heavy guard. But there's a problem, right? There's always a problem. I can't get it open. And believe me, I tried. Bent a nice set of lockpicks in that stupid door. One of the Duke's guardsmen must have the key. They wouldn't just lock themselves out of the castle. I hope. <laughs> Why else would the party be in the garden? He probably has someone breaking a window right now. I could make that work, actually. But in the meantime, let's find someone with a key. We draw too much attention to ourselves. We should spread out. Talus and I will look for the key. Get out of sight and watch for chevaliers or guards. Let's see what we can find out. Come on. Your Grace, this is the event of the season. <laughs> you have truly outdone yourself this time, Prosper. Ah, at last our mighty heroine. The champion of Kirkwall has the honor of first kill this day. To harm the Wyvern on its own ground is to tempt fate. A terrible risk. But the prize... I present to you this belt crafted of fine Wyvern skin. Wear it well and accept the accolades your due. If anyone wants to laud my heroic achievements, I'm happy to listen. <laughs> <laughs> well said. Do not mind, Leopold. My pet is always so temperamental before dinner. I don't suppose Leopold knows how to fetch or play dead. Alas, <laughs> he seems to think it's our duty to amuse him. My friends, I officially welcome you all to Chateau Hain. Enjoy a taste of Orlesian hospitality. several men who might be captains in the Duke's guard. One of them should have a key. And how do you propose we get it from? How else? We ask nicely and tell him we'll give it right back. <laughs> Brilliant. Why didn't I think of that? Your blood reminds you of the attendee. It's a caprice. Mother used to have a set of them when I was a child. You collect them from everyone you know, then cast them in the fountain and make a wish. It's an Orlesian high society game. From the looks of this crowd, I guess nobody is in a wishing sort of mood. Come on, let's find a way inside. I think it will be Quite the interesting evening, don't you? Stand back. Kahir must like you, my dear Hawk. He's not usually so polite. My dear Hawk, do make yourself at home. My, my. I never thought you'd actually attend, champion. I was hoping it would be a shock. Part of my plan to become the most talked about noble in Thedas. If I'm any judge, your scheme will succeed. What do you think of the party so far? Recommendations for people I should chat up? The gentleman over there is Bantigan of Ferelden, younger brother of the Isle of Redcliffe. And of course, there's Lord Cyril, Duke Prosper's son. Who are the worst in the crowd? Do you see the two young ladies over there? That's Babette and Fifi de Lancé, daughters of the Comte de Lancé. Don't make eye contact. You'll thank me later. I get the feeling that everyone here is a moment away from tearing each other apart. <laughs> Don't get between the Comtesse de Lancé and the wine, or we will certainly see bloodshed. We should probably go mingle a bit more. Sorry, Elegant. Places to go, canapes to eat. You know how it is. It was so nice seeing you, Hawk. 
The hunt was spectacular, was it not? Is something the matter? Uh, my friend here has had a bit too much wine. She needs to sit down inside before she gets sick on a duchess. Oh, oh, I can hear the ocean in my head. Tide goes in, tide go... Ow. That's never a good sign. Very well, I'll see what I can do. Just uh, keep her a few feet away. Let me handle him. As soon as I have the key, we can signal the others. <laughs> My, what a big sword you have. Do they give those to all the Chevaliers? So impressive. Lovely party. Well, he doesn't have it. What? He forgot he'd given the key to one of the servants. What kind of guard forgets that he's locked himself out of the castle? We'll go out there and mingle until we find a way in. Or get so full of caviar and wine we fall asleep. Right. Nothing to worry about. This can still work. So, let's find the servant. How many could there be? One for every cheese tray? I'm trying to stay positive, you know. You did well, Sirrah. Perhaps there is a hunter in you, after all. Champion, it's good to see you again. I'm sure you don't remember me. We met when King Alistair made his trip to Kirkwall. I'm Ban Tegan Guerin. You think I often intervene between Meredith and foreign heads of state? Wait, actually, yes, that's pretty normal for me. You remind me a great deal of someone I once knew. Who is this woman, Tigan? I beg your pardon. Isold, this is the champion of Kirkwall. Hawk, allow me to present our lesser Isold. Tigan, I must speak with you right now about the horrible thing Dulcie de Lancé said. I... of course. Please, excuse me, Monsieur Hawk. A pleasure to meet you. If you speak to Ban Perrin, I don't advise you to bring up the Chantry. Or knickers. We're running out of Monsumant Red. This could get ugly. Mother used to love these coins. She never got to bring hers to the fountain. Why not? You don't get invited to fancy or lesion parties when you marry an apostate. Be careful in this company, Hawk. There are worse things than death, you know. Like talking to Fifi de Monse. Champion! Oh, champion! Could you not have stopped Emil before he fell to such depravity? He didn't actually become a blood mage, Lady de Lance. That was just a rumor. A blood mage I could deal with, but this, this whore he's dallied with, she is insufferable. The horrors she's inflicted on our summer house in the name of decorating, it is an atrocity. Allow me to express my deepest sympathies, Lady de Lance, on the ruin of your summer home. She filled the front room with ceramic cows. Cows, Monsieur Hawk. I cannot bear to think of this any longer. Good day, Messer. All 
always delighted to see you, champion. Yes, Isolde, I'll tell him the story about the undead. Please, excuse me, Sirrah. Can I help you? I've been stung by a bee. I think it's swelling. Maker, am I dying? The swelling is almost as big as your head. Don't just stand there, man. Do something before it's too late. If I die, make sure the world knows. I died at Chateau Hain. I cannot help you, madame. I'm afraid I don't have the key to the chateau. Well, let's find this servant. How hard could it be? Please, stop making such a fuss. Another caprice. How many of these are there, I wonder? A sister Nightingale? Champion! It is good to see you again under less dire circumstances. I... Talis? Leliana, it's so lovely to see you again. You look stunning this evening. Your hair is darling. Did you do it yourself? I get the distinct impression you've met before. Oh, briefly. A long time ago. You meet all sorts of people in Orle. It keeps life exciting. Well, I'm glad you two had this chance to chat. Yes, it was very fortuitous. We shouldn't take up more of your time, Liliana. I'm sure you have things that need attention. Right now. How many servants does the Duke have? One for every stray hair? You know, I really like those shoes. You know, I really like those shoes. Enjoy the party. It's quite the event, you know. Put what you found to good use. I discovered more... social interests. <laughs> How many servants does the Duke have? One for every stray hair? Pardon me, Sir Guard, but could we have a moment of your time? Anything for the Duke's honored guests. I've just encountered some Ferelden band wearing the same outfit as me. I need to change immediately. Her ladyship cannot be seen like this. It would be an insult to two nations. There could be riots, wars! A matter of social life or death. Get me into the castle now. I can see this is a matter of utmost importance. But I'm afraid I do not have the power to help you. Enjoy the party. I cannot help you, I fear. You'll simply have to endure. Come on. Let's find a way inside. An excellent party, I'm sure. And you wouldn't do it, too. Champion, what a surprise. Seneschal, dear, introduce me to your delicious friend. 
Serendipity. This is Sarah Hawk. Awkward. So, can we talk about something else now? The canapes are interesting, aren't they? And everyone here is so... upper class. What an astute observation. We should get moving. Lots of people to greet. It was a pleasure meeting everyone. Don't be a stranger. Sometimes I wonder if we're at war with ourselves. Hmm? Wherever I can get it, honey. Whatever you do, don't try that cheese from the Anderfels. Enjoy the party. It's quite the event, you know. I'm afraid I can't help you. Always delighted to see you, champion. Be careful in this company, Hawk. There are worse things than death, you know. Like talking to Fifi de Lance. My dear Hawk, do make yourself at home. The Duke Prosper's parties are unrivaled anywhere. Come on, let's find a way inside. Can I interest you in some Antivan olives? Or I have some smoked am from the Andrefels. They say it tastes of despair. Wait, does it really? How can ham taste like despair? Why would anyone eat it if it did? That's what the importer said. They all talk like that. This wine has notes of oak and springtime. This cheese tastes of sorrow. Who needs more despair in their diet? What is that good for? I've heard that artists are fond of it. I don't suppose we could have a peek at the kitchens. I'd love to see this hopeless dish in all its glory. I don't know. I, I shouldn't leave my post. What a scandalous reprieve from olive duty. Think of what the other servants will say. The upstairs maids will be so jealous when they find out. Very well. Follow me. I know, right? They treat you like part of the furniture. I'm surprised they don't sit on a... Avoid the cheese plate. Terrible. Have you got the key? I'm usually better at this. She didn't have the key either. Uh, this isn't supposed to be so complicated. Maybe we could steal dessert spoons and start tunneling under the wall. That's not terrible. Hang on to that idea. The servant says she gave it to the Duke's son, Lord Cyril. Let's find him and hope he didn't pass it on to his father. So, Lord Cyril. You did well, Sirrah. Perhaps there is a hunter in you, after all. Yes, Isolde, I'll tell him the story about the undead. Please, excuse me, Sirrah. Maybe I should open another cask of the Monfort White. Please, stop making such a fuss. Enjoy the party. It's quite the event, you know. Enjoy the party. It's quite the event, you know. Sometimes I wonder if we're at war with ourselves. Hmm? Wherever I can get it, honey. Be careful in this company, Hawk. There are worse things than death, like talking to Fifi de Lance. I can't believe Van Tegan attended this event in such high degree. So now we need to speak to Lord Zero. That should be fun. 
stand back. Kahir must like you, my dear Hawk. He's not usually... The hunt was spectacular, was it not? Excellent. Join us, champion. We were just discussing your famous confrontation with the Kunari leader. You must tell us the tale. It was the talk of Denerim for months. You have never been to Chateau N, yes? Please, allow me to give you this caprice. It's an old custom. My mother spoke often of Leandra. They were great friends when they were young. It's a shame neither could be here. Where are your knickers this time, Perrin? <laughs> Shut up, you painted shrew! What entertaining manners our guests have. <laughs> Don't you agree, Hawk? Talis here has a message for you, Lord Cyril. It seems to be urgent. This should only take a moment, my friends. Enjoy the party in my absence. No, I don't have the cheese tray. You're mistaking me for... I was hoping we could just... Fine, I'll put that in the trash. That wyvern blood has some kick, doesn't it? This is officially my worst night ever. Not Lord Cyril's type. Maybe he just doesn't like elves, or women. Well, you've got one of those factors covered. He has the key. Go get it. What? It's your turn, Hawk. Go on. Seems like I could save time and just assume a plan will fall apart from the start. It hasn't fallen apart. It's just, uh, not entirely cooperating with reality. Just go try something. So, good luck with that. Thanks. Uh, it's your turn now. Hope you have better luck than I did. Tell the elf that her pleas are for nothing. She's pretty enough, I suppose. No doubt there are some men who would like that sort of thing. I thought you might be a man of refined tastes. I have a great appreciation for beauty. I just want some really good things to know about what in this. Why don't we talk again after the party? You have it! Tell me you have it! Was there ever any doubt? Good, then we can find the... jewel and get this over with. You don't sound that excited. It's simply been a long time coming. That's all. This jewel is that important to you? Yes. I suppose it is. I want this part of my life finished. So soon? I heard they were just about to bring out the candied nug. I want to see that. Let me ruin it for you. It tastes like forgotten aspirations. Oh, you have crushed all my hopes and dreams. Let's find that door and get inside. We're looking for the Duke's vault. Always delighted to see you, so is that it? That's the whole game. I'd like to thank all the little people who made this moment possible. Let's just get going. In the name? There's no need for you to die today, friend. Just move on. You never saw us. See? You could have walked away. 
Of course he didn't walk away. That'd be a bad trait in a guard. I know that. It's not like his family can say, we thought he only had to bake cookies. There are other paths. They do not all need to lead to the same destination. Enough. We're here for the heart. I'd like to do this quietly, alert as few guards as possible. What do you think? Don't relish the thought of two dozen guards chasing me around the chateau. Quiet's the way to go. I'm glad you agree. Let's go.